What made you want to, to put your uh, endorsement behind uh, Mr. McIntosh? Well, I, I don't like a lot of Americans. I think our country is at a tipping point. I think we're, we're on the brink of not becoming the United States of America that we grew up with. And we need strong, conservative, proven leadership more than any other time in, in the history of our country, as far as uh, I can see. We say that a lot, but this year it's really true. And uh, David McIntosh is that strong, consistent, conservative, but proven leadership. Uh, we came to, to town. Uh, uh, at the same time, we were both elected in 1994, and uh, we balanced the, the budget for about four years uh, in a row, and passed welfare reform, and uh, began to rebuild our military, and do some things that, that at that time they thought were uh, couldn't be done, and it would be extraordinary. And we, we did that uh, mostly with the uh, uh, Democratic president. So uh, uh, I'm delighted. David is offering himself up uh, for service again, and uh, I, uh, I had the opportunity to get to, to, to know him uh, uh, both during uh, my service uh, in the Senate and, and also after both of us had left the uh, politics. And uh, I'm, uh, I'm honored to be asked to, uh, to come and, uh, and support him. I was delighted to do it. I, you know, given your, your national exposure in both of your careers, uh, and Indiana played a very big role in the last presidential election, uh, can you just talk about how key it's going to be in this upcoming election and, and what it means for Hoosiers? Well, I, I think Hoosiers are, are like Tennesseans and, and everybody else. You know, they, they're, they're looking for, for something that's going to turn this country back around again uh, in the right direction. Uh, you know, we, we, we're, uh, we're stymied now. You know, our economy is not doing anything. Our unemployment is in a terrible uh, condition. Our, our, uh, our medical uh, uh, system in this country is being turned topsy-turvy. There are hundreds of regulations out there that are, that are being written as we speak. We don't even know what the outcome is going to be. Uncertainty. People are afraid to invest. People don't know what their taxes are going to be uh, in the future. And uh, I think that that means that uh, places like Indiana and Tennessee uh, are going to be in the Republican column this next time. And uh, I think uh, people like David McIntosh are, are going to go to, to Washington and, uh, and, uh, and help in restoring uh, the things that made our country great.